can't hardly even see the needle. That's pretty much empty. Well, I guess that's what I get when I forget to order propane early enough. Hello? Hello? Eh. Oh good, it's ringing this time. Hello? Yes, I'd like to order a propane delivery. Well, that kind of sucks, but I knew the tank was getting low. I've been seeing how long I could go between fill-ups, just kind of as a test run. And the last 20% in that tank lasted way longer than I ever thought it would. So I'm really pretty happy with my fuel consumption. It's been about five months since I put propane in. We'll just see how much it uh, costs me today because it's going to be an expensive fill. They fill it to at least 80%. So it's going to be uh, well, something like 400 gallons of propane. I'm not sure what propane's going for right now, but it's going to cost me. So. We're going to take a little break. We're going to wait for the propane guy to show up. I guess if it's uh, not till tomorrow or the next day, I'm just going to work in the coal forge. So we'll see you back here after we have propane. Well, propane's up to $1.85 a gallon. So like I thought, that was a pretty expensive fill. But we're set for at least another four months, depending on how much big work I do in the forge. If I run it down low for small stuff, it's not that big a deal. If I'm doing a lot of forge welding of axes and adzes, that's not going to last so long. I've at least got the advantage of having that 500-gallon tank, so I don't have to worry about it too often. It's really the pits when you're in the middle of a project and you run out of propane and you have to run to town to put propane in the 100 pound cylinders. This is much easier with the 500 gallon tank. It's going to last me for months, so I'm good to go. I hope you found the video to at least be entertaining, if not somewhat educational. I'd love it if you give it a thumbs up and I'd love it if you'd hit that subscribe button if you haven't done that already. I hope you can find time in your day to get out to your shop and make something. Make sure you got enough propane before you get started. But do it safely, wear your safety glasses, and we'll see you for the next one.